What's up, good people? Rashid here with M2G Exterior Cleaning Services. My first wash of the year. Um, I just pulled up, it's 2.45. I'm getting ready to let him know I'm outside, talk to him for a little bit, walk around, see what's going on, and then get started. I'm not gonna actually film the um, the wash. I am gonna do some before and afters, but I just wanna concentrate on getting it done with this first one and get it out of the way, especially cause this is, this isn't a trial run. I done done a lot of testing with my stuff using my cousin's house and all that other stuff and trying to get some things right. So I got to make sure I concentrate. I bought this thing from a friend of mine, but that's a whole nother ball game. Anyway, stay right. tuned. So this is, I got my truck parked here. I'm trying to think of the best way I'm going to do this because he's got cars in the driveway. I think I have enough holes to reach from where I'm at, but... This is where we are. He's moving all the cars out of his driveway now. Uh, he asked me to knock out this patio for him too. I told him I'd do that for free. I'm not gonna bother him on that. Just something I wanted to give to him. We are worried about getting that cleaned up. I did tell him that I can't get all of that off just because it's just somewhat impossible. Let's go ahead and document this too. Little stuff like this, gotta be made aware of because I just don't want that to ever come back on me. This is the dirty side. I know it's kind of hard to see, but this is gonna be the most fun side to try to get clean. Let's go ahead, walk all the way around, keep going. All of this stuff looks good. I'm not worried about any of this. This I am a little concerned about, but it's not hot. So I don't think hot meaning got power running to it. So we should be good. Like I said, he's moving all his cars out now. This is the front side of that. That's real dirty. We are gonna get underneath here real good all across the front of that and we gonna be all right now i do want to show this one part i'm on this hill way up there at that peak my little three gallon a minute machine with an m5 twist just fine I know a lot of times in the industry, people are saying, oh, you can't reach these peaks. You can't do this. You can't do that. That's not even with the shooter tip. That's just the M5 and I can get up there so it can be done. All right, it is 4.36 and I'm out. Um, that's what I wanted, that's, that's about right for what I wanted it to be. Again, this, this, this wasn't a job that I wanted to do for time. If you check out my channel, you go to some of my other videos, I've shown you where I've done two-story houses, even bigger than his, in an hour 15 from start to finish. And I mean, literally just go. Um, so it can be done. So don't get me wrong. This wasn't a job that was meant for time, but I'm happy about it. My first actual complete job of the year, paying job of the year. Like I said, I've done a couple here and there, just testing out equipment, setting stuff up in my van and whatnot. But, um, I'm happy with it. He was happy with it. And his, his exact words were, it looks like a brand new home. That's what I strive for. I strive to make you feel as though your house is brand new all over again. I didn't do the after video, but I did do after pictures. So I will take those pictures and post them uh, with the video. But overall, I'm happy. I probably could have charged more. I definitely should have charged for that patio. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't think about how big that little patio in the back was. I also didn't think about how dirty it could have been. I don't think that patio on the back had ever been done. That that thing was pretty doggone dirty. It was caked up. So that was one of those situations where it's like, uh, yeah, I probably should have charged, you know, another 25, 50 for that. Something. So I got, got something out of it. But I didn't pre-treat, I didn't post-treat. And because I did it for free, I wasn't going to pre-treat or post-treat. I wasn't getting ready to throw two gallons on that patio worth of pre-treat. I'm not, I wouldn't really hit that with no three or four percent. No, not doing it, especially when I'm doing it for free. So it is what it is. Again, I'm happy. 
first job of the year done. I'm excited. I'm ready to do some more. Um, to hear to hear him say, hey, man, like my house looks brand new all over again. That's the type of stuff that I want to hear. So I'm happy with it. I will say I probably am going to go ahead and upgrade my system, not because of time, but because that pump is probably getting ready to go. And that will be the pump that I'm on right now is my third pump in three years. So I'm not mad about it. I'm really not. But I am maxing those pumps out. I'm doing the most that those pumps are designed to do. When you get a 2.5 GPM or a 3 GPM pump, those pumps only meant to last you for so long. So replacing that pump once a year, that's honestly all you could ask for. You know what I mean? You you buy a $300 pump and you make a few thousand dollars off of it. You actually won in my in my book. You got everything you were gonna get out of that. So. We'll see. I'll probably go ahead and start pricing some stuff. I do want to either get a 301 or a 420 and start hooking some stuff up. Uh, next pump I get definitely is going to be, it's either going to be a five or a six. I will say that I am going to go ahead and go to a five or a six, especially because I got the room now. I said, this is, this is terrible. Don't pay no attention to that. This is terrible. But because I got the room for it now, I'm definitely going to make sure that I utilize it. So I'm probably going to go to a five or a six when I upgrade, but we'll see what happens. Either way, M2G Exterior Cleaning Services here. I love y'all. Have a great day.